This old guy DIY video has to do with a cheap, easy technique to modify an old style bucket with a flipper for catching mice into something new where you have that little modular bait holder. So a friend of mine called after I sent this thing to him last night. He said, hey man, that looks like a great idea, but I don't want to screw around. And on the flipper that I have, where the, the pan effectively is right here, even with the top of the five gallon pail, I don't want to move all that stuff down. How can I make a regular five gallon pail trap into something that has that little bait holder on it? So I gave it some thought. I went out in the garage, grabbed what was left of an Amazon box, uh, one zip tie, one of those little red Solo cups and some tape. Use duct tape if you have it, whatever you like. And all I'm going to do, since I don't have any of the old style that have the flipper right, even with the top of the bucket, I'm going to use this thing to simulate the old style. I'm going to put the cardboard around the edges here and just fasten the cup back here to show you a quick, easy way to convert your old style trap into one of these with a modular bait container. The first step is just to take the cardboard and wrap it around the container, whether it's a five gallon pail or a cat litter bucket. So now effectively we have an area that's caged in here. Now I'm just going to take my knife, punch two holes over here, put a zip tie through to hold that little red Solo cup and we'll be in action. I just picked a spot that would allow the cup to fit above the old style five gallon pail trap. Just put the zip tie through, left the loop, and you can drop the cup or whatever you're using for a bait holder in place. And then it's just a matter of putting a piece of cardboard or wood across the top here and we'll be ready to go. In this case, I took a leftover piece of the cardboard box, put a couple of pieces of tape on the back to act as a hinge. Now we have a little cubby hole where the bait is in there. The critter comes onto the old style trap here, hits that center line, falls in, the bait stays there. For about five minutes work and a cost of 27 cents, you have now turned an old style five gallon pail slip and slide type trap into one that has a little modular bait container. So it's easier for you to keep the thing clean and makes the bait last forever. Thank you for watching. I hope this little technique helped you. Have a great day.